Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is a continuation of the home center video. If you haven't watched that, make sure you go back and watch it after this. You don't need to watch it first, it's not really a big deal. But today we are building the cat cage for my patio and I'm so stoked about it because the weather is so perfect right now and I think Maro is just gonna be thrilled to be able to sit outside and watch the birds and feel the breeze in his fur. So fingers crossed, I can figure out how to do it. Luckily, I have a friend to help. Norm is here. If you haven't checked out his channel, go check out Tokyo Lens. He makes some really amazing documentaries about Japan, but he's gonna help us build the cage today. Today's cat cage building adventure is sponsored by glassesusa.com. Thank you so much. You guys know the drill. They have so many different frames to choose from and you can put prescription lenses in their sunglasses and all the frames they have on the website. They sent me some new sunglasses today, which I'm so stoked to finally be able to wear because the weather is so nice up here in North Japan. These are from the Hilary Duff collection. I recommend and checking out her frames because they're beautiful. They also have a 30 day money back guarantee. So if you guys aren't satisfied with the frames you ordered for some reason, you can send them back, no worries. I'll have my links down below, so check those out. But let's get on to the cat cage building. This is what we picked up at the home center. We got some grass, we got some netting. We got lots of tape because we didn't know which one would work. And I got this awning. I didn't show you guys this last time. It's kind of like um, a bamboo curtain that I'm hoping I will be able to attach to the side of the cage so Maro isn't in like direct sunlight. Over here, we've got the cat cage. So we're gonna start off by putting this together. Really heavy duty. It's pretty nice. I'm so glad that those are already screwed on because that is always a pain in the ass. Looks like there's less of instructions and more of just, just a picture. A picture. I think it clamps into here. Are there really like zero instructions? <laughs> I see none. It's gotta be instructions. <laughs> this is wild. Oh, I found more parts and probably instructions. There's instructions. Yay. Step one, tore ni bakuru o toritsukimasu. God, reading instructions in English is bad enough. I really hate reading them in Japanese. Shazam. <laughs> there we hey, go. It's okay. Cool. Wow, you gonna help? Good boy. You gonna help us? Making a cage. Does it go one more in? I feel like there's too much of a gap there. There we go. Yeah. Perfect. You can't fall through the gap. <laughs> Get stuck in it. I'll be calling you to save him. Okay. It's a good size. I was hoping that when he sat on this, mm. he would be able to look over the edge of the balcony and I think it'll just behind us. Oh, it looks nice. I guess we attach these. Does it give us... Come see your cage. It's all finished. Wanna come see? <laughs> He's so scared of you. Come on. Wow, come see your cage. It's birds, come on. Let's see the birds. Take it out. He's not going to with you there. He's like, hell no. This weird man is not gonna coax me into this cage. I know how to get him in the cage. Tomorrow, I've got a snack. I've got a snack for you. Tomorrow, snack. Your favorite? Your favorite? You want some grass? 
progress. Some grass. Oh my god, he's eating the old grass. No, come here. I really hope this fits. I didn't measure anything, so I was really lucky. I can't believe that. I'm just keep doing that. It's a little wonky, but probably straighten that out. I think it costs like a dollar. I don't expect. Follow the dots. Yeah, that's perfect. <laughs> Mara was like, more cat grass. You can't eat this one. Sorry. So much pressure now that you've talked about wanting it straight. It looks so good though. You're doing a good job. Thank God for those dots. That made it a lot easier. It's a little long, isn't it? <laughs> uh, I think it'll be okay. Yeah. yeah, that's good. Yeah. Awesome. Yay, that's cute. It makes it so much nicer. Oh, you weren't kidding. It's heavy, right? I don't know why. It already looks less crappy. Yeah, it looks really nice, actually. It's really cute. Honestly, that's all that needs to be done to it. This is to protect from the hornets. Mm. But I feel like once we put this on, it's not gonna be as fun for Morrow. Mm. I might let him enjoy it like this and then add that afterwards. Is this, do you mind if I take yeah, it, like, go for it, it. like a bag? Or? It's like a one sheet, one big sheet of netting. Let's see what it looks like when we get one layer of it. How much does it like? That's two layers. Oh wow, it is. You can even just drape it over like this. That's true. I like, if I saw a hornet, I would bring him in right away. <laughs> yeah. Should honestly. I just do that? This looks very really bad. I've done a terrible job. <laughs> it's so sad. These damn hornets. He'd be able to enjoy the breeze so much better without that, but I really need to protect him from them. So I will put that on there one day, but I think I'll let him uh, enjoy it before the sun goes down. Yeah. Let's put it outside. Watch it not fit on the patio. I actually oh haven't measured God. that. I was so. <laughs> I'm so excited to find out. It might not, to be honest. Alright, here we go. No, oh, no, this isn't fitting. Shit. I'm kidding. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> it's plenty of room. Oh, that's awesome. Looks so nice. It is a little shorter than I was expecting, but he will be able to just see over the edge of the, the patio, so it's okay. What happened? Uh, um, I was trying to help you get a shot. Uh, I got my hand tempered. <laughs>
try? Molly well, looks so sad. She thinks we're gonna leave him out there forever. He's got this look on his face. He like looks up at me like, you come here for one day. <laughs> and now I'm in a cage. What? Wasn't me. Why are you looking at me? He's so pissed. Aw, come up top. Good boy. Come here. Come on, come here. Well, he kind of liked it. Okay, not at all. But I think he will get used to it. Maro's very cautious about new things and new places. So he was probably wondering why the hell he's in a cage. And he's a little freaked out. But I think once I get him used to being in the cage inside, he'll be okay. I would like to think so anyways, because that took a while to build. <laughs> Thank you so much to GlassesUSA.com for sponsoring this vlog and for the awesome sunglasses. If you guys would like the link to these frames, I will have them down below. I think they're really cute and I got my prescription in them so I can see now. Thanks for watching you guys. I hope you enjoyed that and I hope you're having a good, It's almost, I feel, it feels like summer, but it's spring, isn't it? I hope you're having a good spring so far and I'll see you guys again very soon.